guys, welcome back to the Comedies of Louis B channel. As you know, this is my first reviewing, um, you know, video review of a figure. I'm going to start doing one of these every time. Um, but today, I remember I told you guys about the SH Monster Arts Godzilla King of the Monsters figure. Which I'm about to review right now. As you can see, the Godzilla King of the Monsters SH Monster Arts, the I mean, I mean, I mean, wait, 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 SH Monster Arts Godzilla King of the Monsters 2019, basically for the Godzilla King of the Monsters movie. I already opened him. Uh, he came in the mail, I believe. He came in the mail on Thursday, which is he came in the mail on June 19th, 2019, instead of coming June 24th, which is really. It's a really big surprise for me in these scenarios, but um, without further ado, let's review this SH Monster Arts Godzilla. Uh, since I already opened them, um, you I'll just put all, everything in the box that he comes with. So we're just gonna review the box. Here's the box. Um, it has a Godzilla logo right here. You can see with the mouth open. It says Godzilla 2019 from Bandai and Tomashi Nations. It shows that it's 2019 and it's, you know, the timeline 65 years, 1954 to, tw 1954 to 2019 in a Godzilla. Um, Toho, Legendary. And the bottom of the box, I don't know if it's unreadable. And um, the God, it shows the Godzilla figure. Right here, it shows the figure of the Godzilla figure too. And, you know, it has a photo of the Godzilla figure. Printed on the box has the SH Monster Arts Godzilla 2019, which is this is my first God's Godzilla SH Monster Arts. If you guys didn't know, this is my first SH Monster Arts. Not my first. I already have SH Figure Arts, but I don't have SH Monster Arts. As you can see, God's SH Monster Arts Godzilla 2019, and it says uh, MonsterVerse. Looks like a Monarch logo from the movie. If you guys don't already watch the movie, then please subscribe, guys, because uh, yeah. Um. We have like I don't know a picture of him swimming or something, and it's SH Monster Arts Godzilla 2019, or he's standing up, which I think he is standing up pretty much. So, so yeah, this is my first review on the YouTube channel. It has a bunch of different pictures. Him looking like roaring, him uh, going up, uh, roaring, him just sitting there, and him just doing the the really iconic in the movie scene. Um, you know uh fire breathing scene where he does it the original logo that you see all over the box here it just has a little picture of or not a picture but like a little logo of godzilla 2019 sh monster Arts. and uh yeah you guys want to uh, box him all you have to do is there's usually tape here i already opened it um and you just open it and get this you know plastic out and then just take the figure out but uh, i guess we should review the accessories First, starting off with this, we come with this uh, piece. It's really cool. It has really good, you know, um, detail because it's just the blue fire. We all know these, but these this is kind of spiky for the kids and, and people. So just be aware of the spikiness right here. But yeah, this comes with a figure. You can put them on the mouth, inside the mouth. We'll check it right now. This is all I have to say about this accessory. And in the box, I have a um, like atomic breath coming out of this right here, and um, of course a mouth. I'm gonna give you guys all of my, you know, thoughts about this figure. So will you be prepared. Um, this is just a piece. So that's an accessory, which is nice. People, they're doing themselves. Yeah, they're out doing themselves this year. We put the box to the side, and we have the full figure to see everyone. So uh, we should start reviewing the figure. And yeah, I also brought my camera, the one I said it's HD. Um, it's right here. I only brought it for the light. He has a light, so I'm just gonna, don't mind the camera, just, here is just, like, more of the camera, 
lights right away. Good lighting. There is it. There. Now we have better lighting. Um. So here is my SH Monster Arts Godzilla, which we're gonna start with the uh, articulation, shall we? And then we're gonna get to the deep start. Um. Here we have the um. You know, we're gonna start from toe to head instead of head to toe. So, um, you know, here we have the articulation of the foot. It moves. Oops. It pops off too if you uh, use a little bit of, you know, force on there when you put it in. It's really easy to put in, actually. It's no bug at all. But uh, I was just trying to move it for articulation. It doesn't. I was trying to move it this way. But like simply it doesn't move that much it goes like this right here it just goes um if you guys can see that it goes like this foot goes like this and then the whole foot moves i don't know if it goes oh it goes 360 360 degrees i don't i don't think i don't think it's recommended in or it's any in any good way it's not good to rotate it 360 because it might break the figure or snap something like that. and moving on to right this little thing it's kind of unnecessary oh the, the camera turned off i guess we can use it when we really need it for close-up right here it moves this and then it moves right here which is kind of unnecessary you know but it's an that's what sh monster arts is it gives more uh articulation have this neck piece that moves um you can also pop off the head and this you can see this it, it has like a rotation thing this helps it like you know move the head simply oh oops you, you can actually pop this on just like that um then you can you can make the figure look up and like this and like like this rotate and you can just go up you can also open the mouth too if you really want to you can just open the mouth like that it's really easy um yeah and then we to the spikes you know it's the same thing you can see everything moving it's weird and um the tail i couldn't get this part on it was really hard so i just left it like that we can move the tail like this or maybe to the it's kind of hard so don't really try to do that um yeah don't really try to do that and uh you can also move the arms go into the arms you can move them but they won't move 360 and yeah but um they're really nice like right here you can move them right here and the whole arm but not all of the arm can move so yeah and then you just have this whole figure you know um and yeah, it's really nice. I guess you guys would want to see me put this through. So, uh, this is how you do it. You just pop the mouth off. Just open it. Pop it gently. Like so. Just It's an extra piece. Um, and right here, it has a little joint. I don't know if you can see that here. Let me get the, the camera. It's a little, little joint. You know, and, um... You know, it's really, it's really cool, a uh, joint, um, and then you could just, right here, there's a hole, oh, I have to use it again, right here, there's a hole in the Godzilla figure, if you can see that, and you can just put this through the Godzilla figure, which will eventually, if you force it right, on yeah then we have this finally just put it through and there's a lot of complaints that this is like falling off this piece so the um, yeah but here it is before it falls off it falls down on off on me here's a little yeah it's really nice um but uh it's really cool i really like you guys are probably wondering, can you make the mouth go up, The you know, the Godzilla figure? I'm going to try that, but if I can't, then uh, we'll see what we can do. Oops. Okay, so first I guess we're going to move this up. Oops. See, that's like the problem people have with it. 
I'm gonna pose it. Um, yeah. It just won't do it. Look, this is what happens. That's the complaint. So I'm gonna have to get something to support it, guys. I got something to, rep you know, support it, but, uh, you know, simply, this is what I got. So, yeah, this is really what I got, but, uh, other than that, I can't really put it up. I'm gonna add on to detail, so I'm gonna take this off. This. And I'm gonna start putting this on, because, you know, of course. Alright. Like, so I got it. Um, but guys, uh, have you guys seen the Luis's report card video? Hopefully you guys did, because... I mean, that one was hard to do. Look, you can also move the mouth this briefly. This is just like, this all you can bring the mouth down, which is pretty long. It's cool. Um, do this. So for the detail, they did a pretty great job, you know, with the feet. They uh, nailed it, actually. You know, these feet were good. They, they really want you to nail the feet. I like the feet. They're really cool. They're like chicken feet, but it's it's cool. It's better than the other one. Uh, I'll show you guys at the end of the video the what, comparisons. Um, Simply, everything was good on these SH Monster Arts. The NECA one, when I got it, it was really cool. Okay, guys. It was like, whoa, I just got the best figure ever. I was like more a child 24 when i was 2014 and i just thought it was really cool but then i got bored and bored so i bought this dude with my money and he just he just was really nice and the detail on this guy is really nice you know if you can see through the light it is really really nice you know look there's a little brief there and i think this SH Monster Rights is really cool after being my first one. It was really cool. A lot of people started saying, oh my god, it's um, probably going to fall off. And I looked at reviews and everything, and it looks pretty cool. So the detail on the face, too, if you guys can uh, see that, the detail on the Godzilla's, on Godzilla's face was really, really cool, actually, um, if you guys can see it. Right here. Yeah, he was really cool. I like how the mouth moved and everything. And, you know, the NECA one didn't have much articulation. I mean, it was cool, but I just wanted to do one. And this one looks really bad. I had a new 2014 Godzilla. So, it's pretty my. I really liked it. And I saw the new NECA one, and I was like, eh, it's just the same repaint. And I kind of got off of that. And I looked online, and I saw this guy, which was way better. And the detail on the tail, man, it's pretty cool. Um... These spikes too, like uh, they get me a lot. There, they're cool, and the then the um the eyes. They said that they were really bad on the Neko one and on the sometimes on the SH Monster Arts, but this one has really good eyes. I really want to show it to you guys, but um simply, you know, it's it's really hard. It's like all shadowy in my room, and like they haven't fixed the light, so yeah, and you know, yeah, but. You know, it's a really detailed figure. I love it, guys. You guys know it. You know, subscribe to the channel. Come on. You know, subscribe. Hit that, you know, red subscribe button. Hit the notifications to get notified of every new video I have. And, yeah. So, I guess that's pretty much it. I mean, this is a really good figure.